We did buy a house. Um, when I tell you, God will give you double for your trouble because they be in the same subdivision that I lost my old house. Now. I seen five dollars clearance and I had to win. Playing with makes me wonder who you think playing with. I'm just a myself to keep playing this. Make her back over and over again. Sweat change, but I know that's the end. E gang, it's your girl Ebony Elbow back to you with another bliggity vlog. If you're new here, baby, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because you are gonna like it. Welcome back to my OGs. Today is Friday morning. Happy Friday, everybody. I didn't pick up the camera Thursday, I didn't pick up the camera Wednesday. Sometimes, you know, you just need to, I don't know. You need to just like decompress. When, you, when you're a content creator, sometimes it can be overwhelming trying to like vlog everything so i took a couple days off but we back we back full throttle we back in the swing the vlog about to be back out full throttle i just needed a couple days off just a couple we ain't gonna do no weeks and all that but anyway last night we went did a little shopping i got some more um spring clothes for the boys so i want to show y'all everything i got this is from burlington so i got these little trunks for katie which they trunks, but you know, in the south of here in Duval County, we wear them in shorts. So they're Tommy. They got like a little Tommy emblem right there. They're just red, white, and blue. And then I found this really cute Tommy shirt. Hold on, I got two bags for Burlington. I found this really cute Tommy shirt to go with it. I thought this was really cute. So it says heel figure. So that's cute. So that'll be one outfit. That's cute to me. And then I found, and those shorts were $24.99. The shirt was $16.99. And these shorts is $24.99 also. Shirt, uh, $16.99 also. So I got these blue ones and it says heel figure right there. And then I got this yellow shirt to go with. I hate how they just throw the clothes in the bag and they don't fold them. They get wrinkled. So I thought that was cute. Says heel figure. And then I got uh, Cam just some tees. This one is just a Nike tee. Says Nike there. Um, Kate in this Gap shirt. That shirt was $8.99. This Gap shirt was $6.99. This is a Gap shirt to wear with some jeans or something. I like, I really like this color. I hope it's coming off on camera. Um, Kate and Cam, just this little Nike shirt, $8.99. My total at um Burlington was $200. I got Cam this Nike set. I thought this was really cute. It's a little shirt, but the back, it says like it got the thought that was cute and then the the details like the black I like how the black on there and even got a little black on the back of the shirt that's cute so I thought that was a cute set and then he has on a set now because today is King Day we still going on y'all I'm ready for this A B C D E F G to be over if you don't know Cam is doing a through Z until his uh, VBK graduation. So every day is something different. So today is K, so they had to dress like King. So I had to go, I was trying to find like a robe and a little stick they be having, but I could. I ended up finding a King hat at Party City last night. And I just put them on like a cute little linen outfit that I got at um, Burlington. Also, it was $16.99. It's really cute. And I went to Target and I found him like some cute little shoes. I'm gonna show y'all, but yeah. I got these boxes for Cam. It was True Religion. They were only $6.99. I thought that was good. And it came with one, two, three, four, five. He put one on this morning. So those are cute. $6.99. Cam always taking his socks off. I don't know what it is. Y'all probably be seeing it on the camera. So I got him these little bedroom shoes. And these were only $3.99. I don't be wanting him to get sick. I got Cam, Kaden. This American Eagle shirt. I like this color. Spring colors. $7.99. And then I got Cam from <coughs> Goggles. We do a lot of pool activities in the spring and the summer. So water activities, not just pool. So I got him some Sonic Goggles. These are cute. Look at them, y'all. 
They're really cute. And it's a Sonic right there. And then, um, y'all look what I found, Jewel. Look at this. It's a little outfit, and it got the little purse. Girl, look at that. Girl, look, with the little hat. Girl. So cute. So cute. That is so cute. I hope y'all can see. And then, I got some other, like, little miscellaneous stuff from, um, Burlington and like some bubbles for Jewel birthday party, just little stuff. Um, just a two pack of bubbles. I got two of these. I got like a little um decor. What is this? I went to Target also. What is this? Oh, y'all, let me put y'all on. These right here from Target. These red velvet cup. Run, don't walk, run. These red velvet cupcakes, better than Publix, better than Cami Cake, better than, they so good and rich and flavorful. Also, the carrot cakes are good too. I got, I put Boo on, this is his first time having it last night. He was like, it's so good. These right here, y'all, Target, I'm telling you. I don't know who to, I think this is Target brand. I think it's made by Target. Girl. I'm telling you, y'all gonna come back and be like, Ebony, you was right. They so good. It's a, it's a, it's, it's somebody from the South cooking that. It's somebody from the South cooking up that recipe. And then I just got another one of those dresses because I like the way the other one fit, but I got a different color. And it's still circle week, so this was on on sale for nineteen dollars. So this is cute. It's just like the other one I wore. Come to the knees. Spring colors also. And then y'all, they had the neutral. Okay, I'm here go your little toy that you beg for. Here, y'all beg for this toy. Um, they got the neutral colors. I haven't seen these yet, so y'all know the little 50 cent cups and plates and stuff. So they had the neutral colors. I thought these was cute, and the bowls are shaped differently. So that's cute. I got some of these because I don't know why my bowls always go missing. I didn't need any plates, but I like these colors. I just got two bowls always missing. I don't know. And then I got some more cups. Cups definitely always missing. They had the neutral color. Cups also. So yeah. And let me show y'all Cam outfit. Let me show y'all Cam. Come here, Cam. So y'all, this Cam little linen outfit. Look at the detail. No, this is not linen. I don't know what it is. This like a towel material. But it reminds you of a linen outfit. It is so cute. And then I got those shoes. Hold your shoes up, baby. I got these from Target. They were $20. Turn them to the side. <laughs> and then he has on his little king hat. So look at my boy. So cute. You look cute, Cam. And he's sleepy, y'all. Good morning. Thank you for choosing Wendy's. Hi, can I get a four-piece order of French toast sticks, please? Anything else for you? That'll be it. You can pull around to the second one. Thank you. All right, y'all. I'm getting Cam some breakfast. Um, his daycare do not provide breakfast or lunch. We have that's why y'all see me pack his lunch every day. So, and normally he don't really want breakfast. I try to make him get like a banana or something. But he been saying he been hungry at school, so I want to make sure he get his breakfast. Good morning. How you doing? So yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna let him get that syrup because I don't want him to get it on his shirt. You gonna be? No, he sleep, y'all. He knocked that. Thank you. Yes, please. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. So y'all, how about which I read? I knew Katie didn't have school today, cause I, you know, he has a teacher, and I don't know. My mind said, is today King Day or is it Monday? Cause I don't think it's school. So he, so Cam goes to VPK full time. That's why I still have to pay. If he just went part time, you know, it's free. But he goes to school full time, so that's why we still have to pay. So he had school today, but today was a King Day, so. I was thinking about it when I was in the car. I was like, why none of these kids dressed up as I'm walking back to the car rather I wasn't in the car yet. So I ran back into school and I was like, I don't think today King Day. I think it's Monday because I think VPK is close today. So I see Cam running stuff in the King hat in his um cubby because he ain't bad. <laughs> Y'all, he is so easily, my kids are so sensitive like me. He is so easily embarrassed. So he embarrassed that he the only one got on the King hat. 
Mm-hmm. Or whatever. So he's stuffing it in there. Then he see me like, and I'm like, today's not King Day, is it? And I talked to her. She's like, no, it's Monday because there's no VPK today. Y'all do y'all know me and Boo ran all over the town looking to make sure he had something that represents a king last night so now i got more time like i could order him something off of amazon now since it's monday like a real king with the robe and everything because y'all know i'm extra like he won the cowboy contest well it's not a contest but they say he was the best dressed cowboy because i had the, the horse and everything y'all seen me so now i got to find him something for a king this is getting expensive this is getting expensive so yeah me and mama get him like a little tuxedo or something But yeah, girl, it was so funny to me because I was like, look at him. He was, girl, he was stuffing it in the thing. He didn't think I was coming back in there. He is so, him and Katie, they are so sensitive just like me. Oh, whatever. But yeah. I was about to go look at some houses this morning before I went to work. Like to say some neighborhoods of boo. Like, where you at, babe? I'm like, Sometimes, like sometimes I just take my I don't know if y'all do this in the mornings I just take my time like you know cause I, I work the late shift which I love so I just like take my time like getting back home or if I want to just ride sometimes I just go to Target in the morning just something like just sometime with me just by myself like I, I think it's very important I was just watching somebody else while they was just saying how important it is to spend time with yourself and it's something I've always did um I go out by myself. I go out to eat by myself. I go to a coffee shop by myself. I do anything by myself. And sometimes it's needed away from the kids, away from the husband, just time by yourself. So that's what I like to do a lot of mornings, if, especially if I'm not walking. Like me walking, that was so therapeutic for me and time to myself and with nature and trying to get back in my zen. Cause y'all know I was trying to get in my zen. But anyway, I said I to say, I was just, me and Cam took our time. Y'all know we got breakfast and I had pulled over, let him eat a little bit or whatever. And I was going to go look in some houses. The model homes are open. I'm just going to ride through the neighborhood or whatever because I need to make a decision this weekend. And um, he was like, I got a surprise for you. Come home. So I don't know what he up to. I don't know. I was like, babe, I hope you didn't cook because I was like, I'm not trying to be rude, but me and Cam just got breakfast because I don't want to like walk in the door and it's food and I can, y'all know I can't eat that much at one time anyway. So like, oh my God, did you cook? He was like, no, it ain't that. I was like, thank you. So I don't know what it is, but yeah, call y'all back. Again, it's later on in the day. My surprise was, so y'all know I told y'all with me being off schedule, my room was a mess. Like I told y'all I wasn't gonna couch y'all my room. I, my room get dirty sometimes just like other people. Like I ain't always on point. So my room was a mess. So when I came home, y'all had only been gone maybe... 30 minutes if that the room was spotless i'm talking about he had to fold all the clothes put the clothes up vacuum like i was like like y'all know i tell you like we had gender roles in our house so cleaning the room is not something boo normally do like that's he'll help he'll wash dishes he'll help me cook he'll do that but cleaning the room like if he home and i'm home and i start throwing shit real hard he know get his ass up and start helping me but just to clean the room on his own. So that was my surprise. And when I told, I like, I, I'm going to tell y'all, like I told him, that's one of the best gifts you can give me ever. We're better than any materialistic thing you could ever buy me to clean up the room on your own. And girl, ain't nothing like coming home to a clean house and a, especially a fresh, clean room where you spend most of your time with me. That's why I spend most of my time because I work from home. Baby, I was just like, oh, he had to put in a new um Bath to Body Works plug in, baby, or um Wallflower, baby. I was like, look at you. So y'all, don't tell nobody. But so tomorrow, I was gonna try to do it tonight, but it's just gonna be too much. So tomorrow, because I'm trying not to spend money like I was, not blow too much money, because we was gonna go back to the field, just me and him. We might still do that. I don't know. I'm thinking about doing like a date night in. So, I need to look on Amazon, see if they got, like, one of those couples games that could come by tomorrow. Um, I'm going to cook, like, his favorite food. He loves seafood, so I'm going to cook, like, some seafood. Um, maybe, like, set up some candles or something, because the boys are going to be going with their dad. So, yeah. Anyway, we're about to go get Cam from daycare, and then we're going to go look at a couple of houses. 
So this will be, I, I don't know if I already said this, it will be the final house hunting vlog because a decision will be made. Like, yeah, before this vlog go out, a decision will be made. So, yeah, and then I'm going to look at those houses, come home, get them ready to go to their dad, and then I'll hook back up with y'all. Okay, y'all, we're about to look at a home in this beautiful neighborhood. So, yeah, let's see. It's going to be huge. I think this neighborhood is going to have, like, the upwards of, like, four or 500 homes. It's huge. It's going to be huge. So, yeah, this is it. This is by KB Homes. I'll start seeing the builders because I know in the last video I didn't and I'm sorry. So I will start seeing the name of the builder. I normally try to remember and I guess I forgot. But yeah, let's find the house. So this is the home. Now look how Cam came home dirty. So this is the house. Oh, okay, y'all see the sun. Let's go in. So it has like these columns here at the front. What, one, two, three, four. The porch is fairly big. I mean, I guess you could put like a little bench right there. So let's go in. This is a really tall door. Can y'all tell? This is the type of door I like. This is really tall. Yeah. Okay, so this is the bathroom. So I like this because it's not just a powder bath, it's a full bath. Because this, they made this, a, instead of an office, they made it a bedroom. You can make this an office or a bedroom. But they made it a bedroom so with a closet. So when you make it a bedroom, you get a full bathroom. Right here, it does have brown cabinets. I'm not opposed to brown cabinets. It's just not my first choice. Um, This is really big. I want to step back out so I can show y'all. This is huge. This walkway is huge. Got your steps right here to the left, but we'll go in there later. I mean, up there later. So this is a closet, and this closet wraps all the way around. So that's cute. Um, This is the garage. This is, um. so this is what I was telling y'all. I don't know if I told y'all in the video on the reel or something. I, this this is not my favorite when like the dining room is here and the living room is right there. I kind of I don't like them to flow together. I kind of like them separate, if that makes sense. But this is it. It's big. I mean, inevitably we really won't use this area. It's just for decoration for guests when they come over. But they do pre-wire to hang your TV on the wall. Um, lots of natural light coming in here. There's no electricity on right now. And it's a lot of natural light coming in here. So I really like that. I'm coming, baby. It's a big kitchen. This is my favorite. I freaking love a window while you're washing dishes. Lots of cabinet space. Look at all this cabinet space. Look at all this. Lots and lots and lots of cabinet space. That's one thing KB does do is they put a window above the sink. And I like that. Pantry. It's not huge, but it's not, it, I, it's doable. So come on, let's go upstairs. So let's go up here. So we're at the landing of the steps and I like how that big window is there. So bringing some natural light. This is the loft, it's a good size. Windows here. So yeah, show y'all the loft this way. So we will probably do like the TV on that wall. And I want to do theater chairs and chairs here. So y'all know a loft is a must have on our list. <coughs> Whoa, master bedroom. This is huge. This is huge. <coughs> wow. I know y'all can't tell from camera, but this is huge. I probably will opt to add, you can't add another window, probably like another window over there. Just to bring in a little more light. <coughs> Closet. It's a good size. I would get all that and then Boo would get this little corner. You like this bathroom? Yes. Bathroom. No tub. Just a shower. It does have a um a niche. So um you can 
I think, I do think you have the option. Yeah, okay, so you can make this the shower, no, and then this will be the tub. You can encase that, your water closet. Well, that's the toilet. Yeah. No, the toilet goes right there, baby. And then it has the brown cabinets up here, too. This master bedroom is huge, huge, yeah. huge, huge. Let's go take out my room. Your room? Okay. It's a closet, HVAC. Another bathroom. Another bathroom. It has the built in vanity. <gasps> Look! Shower. There's no electricity yet, baby. Laundry room is huge. Yeah. Laundry room. Bedroom. This is a good size bedroom. It's a nice size bedroom. Wow, that's a big closet. <clears throat> and then, so, another bedroom. Nice size closet. So it's a four bedroom with the one downstairs. Four bedroom, three full baths. Let me know how y'all like this one. Okay, this is the second house. Come this way, camera. So, stone at the front. Porch. I guess you could put like a little bench right here. Let me come this way so y'all can see. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This is the front bedroom. I mean, this is so gorgeous. Yes, you know what I mean. I meant fourth bedroom. Um, and this no. wow, this is a walk-in closet. So no, that's this nice. This work one. This the work. This she just wanted me to see this floor plan to see if I like it. Mom, it's not a two-story. This is storage. HVAC. Um, this is a long, pretty good hallway. Yeah. This is the um, what do you call it? Laundry room, bath. Okay, it does have white cabinets. I don't white cabinets. Tub. So that tub is gonna be tiled. That's good. I like tiled tubs. What's the base price on this one? Okay, and then this is another bedroom. Maybe this can be the bathroom. Yeah. This is the third bedroom. These this bedroom is a little small. But I mean, the boys want their own rooms now. So, I mean, just a little bed in here. I'm thinking that Kate and the Cam will probably get like full size beds. And then, come on, camera. Okay, so master bedroom. It's long instead of wide. It's long. I mean, it's big though. It's more length than width. Let me stand back so y'all can see. It's pretty big. This is the bathroom. I have to ask her what type of floors are gonna be in here. White cabinets, those are pretty. Shaker style. Are those shaker? No. Um, Closet. Okay, this closet is really big. Can y'all tell? Really big. Uh -oh. It's a water closet. This is the shower. Camera. Yeah. And then it's here. Okay, I like the. Oh, oh, wow. Okay, bitch. Okay, this what you, this what she wanted me to see. Okay, so they built this. This is gonna be a gourmet oven. So double in the wall. KB does have that option as well. Look at all this cabinet space. You would have the flat cooktop because you got the gourmet oven. Stand back and look at this kitchen, girl. So much cabinet space. Wow. Wow. That would be a selling point for me. So this is your living room. I guess dining room here kind of weird layout because like what would go right here okay that's kind of weird i guess this would just be oh would you put like a breakfast table here or something like a breakfast nook table i don't know but definitely living room there dining room kitchen is definitely a selling point for this house 
see how y'all like this kitchen and then closet i mean pantry this is cute hey e gang see uh, -uh that's shaking but anyway, it's later on. It's 7.32. Um, the boys are gone with their dad. So I got a little weekend to myself. So, um, yeah. So I'm headed to this whole, this store called At Home. I don't know if y'all have an At Home in your city, but cause Boo is cleaning the building. Friday nights, I don't typically don't go at Boo to clean the building. So it's a little while before he come home. So he cleaning the buildings and i'm just about to waste some time i'm gonna stop in this adult novelty store and see if they have like any games on hand before i try to order something from amazon tonight but i want to look at at home i just want to look walk around look, this stuff made me happy get ideas because one thing we know for sure is we're getting a new house even if we don't know where yet we know for sure we're getting a new house so i just want to look at stuff get some ideas you know it don't help the, I mean, it don't hurt the window shop. Y'all know I like shopping. It makes me happy. So, yeah, girl. And then we go do that. And then I'm trying to figure out what we're going to do for dinner. I really want to go to the, um, to the crowd place. I was just watching Grace Live. I know y'all, I already know y'all some Grace girlies because I've been told y'all to follow her. Shout out to Grace on 7K. But, baby, she was eating the crab. Boy. And she made me want one so bad. And then I was watching Grace. Then I get on I, after Grace, I cut on its court video. And then she made me hungry. And I'm like, oh my God. I want one so bad. But when me and Boo go, it's never under hundred dollars. Cause he loves oysters. I like oysters. And they be like twenty dollars. Twenty sometimes it depends on the market rate per dozen. But I, I'm craving it so bad. What y'all think? I almost, I'm almost want to go with just going there by myself. I, if it was any other restaurant, I would not even second guess going by myself. But Boo love that place, and I know he gonna be like, "You really left me," because he would not do me like that. If it was anywhere else, I'd go by myself. He wouldn't care. But there, he gonna be like, "You left me." So, I don't know. We got to think about it. We got to think about it. Because I don't feel like waiting for him. Well, you know this is super fast. I ain't lying. Give me sex. Give me sex. Booty shorts. Okay. We're at home goods. I'm talking about home goods. We're at at home. So, let's go in here and see what they got. Are we going to buy something? All right, let's go in. So cute. This is so cute. Yeah, I even. Where at? All right, y'all, look at this. This is cute. How much is it? The only thing, like, this would be decoration because my kids would get this so dirty. I, like, need to be practical. With the boys, they're still young. Hell, boy, get it dirty, but that's cute. I like these. I would want it in black or white for aesthetics only, but the black would be functional. Y'all remember I used to have these cognac chairs? Well, I had the Target ones, but I had that color. For some reason, I'm really feeling these natural wood looking chairs. These are $129 a piece. You better off just getting that set with the egg chair and stuff. But I'm really feeling this. What y'all think? I'm really feeling that. Cute. Cute. Once more, y'all like type. Like stuff like this. Like, what is this? Like, what do you call it? Wicker? No, that's not wicker. It looks like wicker, but. Hmm. I don't know. What's y'all Do y'all like chairs like that? Do y'all like stuff like this? I mean, that stuff is more cheaper. $69.99. If I was doing like a, a 
how I was doing at my old house, like the boho natural thing, I would definitely get this for my kitchen up. This is cute with that table. That is cute. How much is it? The table is $3.99. Yeah, that's the table only. Oh, the chairs are cheap, y'all. They only $60. At home, come get it. Y'all, the is it comfy? Oh, they pretty comfy too. Good and sturdy. You can hold all this ass. Yeah. This is very modern and sleek. Like a marble top. Can y'all see? It's a glare. And then the chair. Really sleek chair. Modern. $179. Oh, these are $179 per chair. Holds up to 300 pounds. area so you can see how the pieces will look together if this is your theme this is cute natural colors earth tones it's cute see how they do that if that's your theme this i never seen you want this narrow okay that's different to match like the different times of year like how they added these summer pillows do y'all do that I wasn't spending no money right but y'all know I had been looking for a bigger wall art for the boys room and this is perfect that's perfect I mean we still do have about five months and I feel like one of them they're gonna get separate rooms but I feel like one of them I'm gonna do a game room decor anyway of course new comforter but I can still use this at the new house does that make sense Probably Kaden, more than likely, because he likes the game. Cam do too, but Kaden is a bigger boy. So, I, long story short, I feel like it won't go to waste. It's $44. It's perfect. It's black and white, just like the Fortnite. Yeah. Look at this, y'all. I think this is so pretty. 
this texture, hold on, not this, I'm moving this out of the way. But this, look at this texture. I hate how camera don't really be picking up true colors, but I like that. I actually like this mirror as well. What is this, like, oh, this wood. Like if I feel like they have something for everybody's theme. Whatever your theme is, they got it. Let's look at some more pictures. So this is pretty. It's pretty. E game, what's y'all like theme? Are y'all like a neutral aesthetic? Are y'all more modern? Or do you like like the new I won't say new, it's been around a little minute, but like the neutral tones, the cream couches, the black and the whites. I like the black and the whites, but I like mixing a little more modern with it. Do you like something like this? Like, I don't know. I, like I told y'all, I try not to do what everybody's doing. I love the neutral aesthetic. Don't get me wrong. I love it. But I do like modern. So I try to mix modern with the neutral in my house. My last house, if you've been here for a while, I did boho theme. So I did like stuff like that, pictures like that, a lot of wicker, wood wicker baskets, like a lot of stuff like that. And I'm kind of over that. So I want to go back modern, but yeah, I, I kind of know what I want, but I kind of can't. I don't know. Like I know what I want. I know what I want to do, but I don't know what I want to do. I don't know. Like. Let me, I feel like I need to explain it. Like, I know the theme I want for my house. I'm just trying to figure out how I want to execute it. If that makes sense. So I know what I want. It's the execution that we got to figure out. And the biggest thing right now is my... I don't know. We'll cross that bridge. Y'all, this store has so many pictures and stuff. I don't want to bore y'all because I don't know if y'all like these type of videos. So I don't want to show you go down every aisle. But y'all remember this painting from school? I think everybody saw this in school. But, um, yeah, I don't want to bore y'all with everything because I don't know if y'all like that. But if you got an at-home kit here because they just got something for everybody. They just got so much stuff. But down here, they just have all type of different little whatnots. Cute little stuff. Like I say, whatever your theme is, they got something for you. Sometimes you can come in here and find everything. Sometimes I ain't going to lie, come in here and don't find anything. But yeah, whatever you like, we got it. Oh, yeah. oh, I cannot wait to decorate my front porch. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, it's not even heavy. It's full concrete. Oh my God, look at this. Love, girl. Y'all need to stick around for the house decorating content because, baby, when I tell you, it's going to be lit. Y'all go prepare to be suck on me. This is really nice. It's a sectional. This is so cute. Comes with the pillows. It's a rounded sectional. And these chairs. $2.49 a piece of chairs. I don't know how much the sectional is. Let's see. Okay, sectional $6.99. So these are all the prices, y'all. It's about, about $16, $17 to do the whole thing. And this, somebody was thinking about putting this out here with it. This is definitely cute. That would definitely go. I like this. Okay, y'all. I just got to Rocking Crab. Y'all know. If we at a crowd spot, this is where we always say, I just got off live. Child, I ain't got but two lashes on and y'all don't about made me cry them off. So if you didn't watch the live, go catch the live. I just wanted to catch up. I haven't, I felt like I hadn't talked to y'all on live in a while since Boo was in the hospital. But, you know, I'm at Rocking Crab. Boo just pulled up too, so. I wanna all night. Say it. I wanna all night. I wanna all night. Say it. I want all night. I ain't no stranger. Babe's been waiting. And just as I recall, I asked still amazing. Yeah. Oh, yeah.
to that improv comedy show. Okay, y'all, I had to pause it. I'm watching Anthony's Too Real. But anyway, hey girl, it's Saturday morning, bitch. <laughs> Not just playing. So yeah, I feel good this morning, y'all. I feel good, I feel good, I feel good. I dropped my little detox tea last night after we had them crowds, baby. Just, just say I had to take two showers this morning. Cause I'm a, I'm a girl, if I go to the bathroom, I got a shower. Yeah, y'all like that, I don't see how people do. I gotta get in the shower. I don't care about no wet wipe, nothing. Anyway, TMI. So, um, I guess them toxins getting out of my body, I feel good. But I'm headed to do my mom's hair. Well, I'm about to drop my car off to Boo now because do y'all remember Boo hit my car? Like, he plays so freaking much. He hit my car. I hope y'all can see me. I hope it's not too much of a glare. Let's see. I didn't put it on the stand. Um, Boo hit my car playing so much. So, he about to fix it. He got to do body work and paint it. Like, it's just one little spot. I don't think I ever showed y'all. But, yeah. So, he about to fix my car. He just left my mom's house. He did something. Y'all, my daddy, too. My daddy used to be able to do all this stuff for himself. He was too weak to do some stuff in the yard. My mom needed done, so my husband went and did it for my daddy. And that just break my heart, because that's something like my daddy always prided himself on. They have a huge yard. You will always see my daddy riding the llama, cutting the grass, or chopping down the trees, or just keeping up. He liked to do stuff like that. And the fact that he's like too weak to do that stuff now, it's just, it just really makes me sad. They had me crying on the live last night. But... So yeah, I'm about to do that. Do my mama hair, do her little quick little nasty bob. I just went and bought her hair this morning too. I've been out early about her hair and you know, the, all the things. So yeah, she don't be wanting to be on camera while she get her hair done. So I'll call y'all, I guess once I get done, I'll show it to y'all. What's up, E Gang? Today is, ooh, child, these little edges. Today is um Sunday. Happy Sunday, fun day. So, y'all, I know I opened up the vlog yesterday and I never came back on. So, I did want to come tell y'all, I did, we did buy a house. Um, I, I'm ending the um house hunting journeys because I don't want to take y'all on anymore. And because like we did buy a house. So we found, I'm not gonna lie, this is something that we've been working on since February. Mm -hmm. So I just still was house hunting because I wanted to make sure I was very sure. Boo, he don't care. He just like, you know, it's, he's like, I'll just make sure you're sure. Oh, I ain't gonna even put it go. Just make sure you're sure. So I wanted to just make sure I was really, really sure that that was the house that we wanted. Um, Yeah, everything was finalized. So yeah, I'm happy with all that. So no more house hunting journeys. Um, unless y'all just want me to take y'all around and look at houses. But for me, I did choose. So I decided that um I'm going to vlog the journey. I'm vlogging everything. I vlogged me us signing the contract. I vlogged um us putting the sign in the yard, the sold sign. It is a new construction home, but I have decided that I'm not going to um post those videos until I close on the home. Just because you just never know what's going to happen. You know, we all pray for the best. And, you know, we wish for the best. But it's just, y'all, I've been through so much. And y'all know me. I changed my mind. I'm indecisive. And even though I know God is going to see me through, I feel really good about this purchase. I got a lot of everything that I want. Most of everything I wanted, I got it. I got my garden tub. I was able to customize things that I wanted to um i was able to pick my flooring and everything my colors and i did choose the gray cabinets so yeah i just i just wanted to be different i feel like everybody doing white and white is so pretty and everything but i just wanted to be a little different but um yeah i was able to do everything that i wanted so i'm really happy about that y'all now it's like crunch time um it's an expensive home um and the seller is helping with closing, but they're not doing the full closing. Um, so yeah, it's a pretty little penny that we gotta come up with. And some couple things that I still need to do. Um, like I was spending my credit, one of my credit cards and was in jail, so just paying that completely off. Um, working on my taxes. So I'm done with my taxes from last year. But yeah, I'm done with that. I want to triple, triple check, but I'm done with that. So just working on paying my taxes down from this year. Well, 2023 from my filing from this year. Um, 
So certain things. So it's, some, it's thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars that we got to come up with. So I say that to say I appreciate everybody who's here. I appreciate everybody who joined the E-Game. I appreciate everybody because y'all know um, it's just, we, you know, like that two income we had. We got two incomes, but that two income from that shop that we had, it's just not there anymore, you know. So, um, yeah, but we're going to do it. And then um, we was working on a really big contract um, when he had got put in the hospital. I'm so glad these lashes falling out, y'all. When he got put in the hospital, so that contract is gone. And that was the upwards of um, like thousands that he was going to be able to bring in for the new house. And he was just going to give it to me, you know, pay his child support and then give it to me. For the house so that's gone but i ain't i ain't worried about it i know my god is good and he gonna make a way like he always do i was on the live last night and i was telling the people and i was joking but i was joking but like but for real like i, I don't know if anybody follow peach mcintyre but when she decided to buy a house like she just told like Y'all don't understand the, like, we cannot do it without child number one, without the views. And I know I work and stuff, but without the, for people who's like full time concrete cadets, even me, I would not be here if it wasn't for y'all. Y'all bring in the views, the views equals revenue or whatever. So, you know, she got the upward of, I mean, she's big. Like, she, I don't wanna, she's over 100,000 subscribers. And she just asked everybody to send her $1. And so many people did it. Um, granted, she didn't buy the house. Um, but I don't know. Like, you know, you guys know, I don't know why. I'm sure something happened. Um, maybe something happened, like, where, you know, she couldn't at the time. But so many people did support her and send her that $1. So I was like, shoot, if Peach could ask, why can't I? Like, I'm a deserving person. I'm like, wow, y'all my subscribers, if y'all want to contribute to the house buying fun if you want to send me just one dollar that will not make or break you you can send me one dollar i will put my cash app on the screen and it is in the description box but yeah imagine if i got every one of my subscribers to send me that one dollar just that one dollar just that one dollar just that one dollar y'all yeah, gonna be helping me get into my home like yeah like oh my god so yeah, if you want to send me a dollar, send me a dollar. Some people actually did send me a dollar last night. Never thought it was gonna really, really happen. Like, so I was telling my friend about it. She was like, well, you need to put it in one of your videos because you said that on the live and everybody don't catch the lives. So you need to put it in your videos. So I was like, I don't know, because you know, so everybody don't receive things the same way. Some people, you know, to be some people over being negative. Oh, what she want out money for? She a YouTube like they was doing peach. Me personally, I sent Peach money. I sent more than a dollar because I just felt like that's what I wanted to do, help her achieve her goal of home ownership. And if it's one of my subscribers on there, it ain't like she was asking for a hundred dollars. She literally was saying everybody sent me a dollar. So, and if one of my subscribers, I mean, if one of, yeah, anybody I follow, anything did it, I would send a dollar. Like what the, what the freak is a dollar? So yeah, um, I'll, if you want to help, that's that. But okay, so. I'm really excited about the home buying journey. The videos will be posted once we close. I'm going to vlog everything for y'all. Um, the house is in permitting phase now because it is new construction. It is expected to be completed at the same time that this lease is ending. So look at God. And I was telling my subscribers last night, y'all know, like I was so upset and hurt about me losing my house and, you know, having to walk away, losing all my money, still having got all my money back. And, when I tell you God will give you double for your trouble, cause baby girl, new house in the same subdivision that I lost my old house, y'all. I don't know if you need to rewind that back. Same subdivision that I lost my old house. Better house, bigger house, custom. I was able to customize it. Y'all know in the other house I didn't have the tub. I wasn't crazy about the bathroom. And sometimes we be, and I'm just, I'm not saying this to brag. I'm saying this to be a testimony to anybody that's going through something because y'all, I literally was on my ass and lost every dime I had. You don't understand it at the time. And you be like, darn God, I'm such a good person. Like, why I keep having to go through this? And you just got to trust it because like, who would ever thought I would be back in that same, because I wanted my kids to be able to go to these certain schools. I'm back in that same subdivision, different builder, better builder, I got my garden tub, I got my gray cabinets, I got the kitchen that I want. I 
I got the marble floors in my bathroom. I just was able to do what I wanted this time. So, yeah, I lost a lot of money. Cried a lot of nights. But baby, the joy that I feel in my heart today, it was all worth it. So anyway, y'all, it's Sunday. The kids haven't made it back from with their dad. Yeah, I'm finna lay these little pieces of edges I got left down. Um, We end up just not doing anything last night. I end up then not doing the little date night, nothing. Girl, I gotta, so I ordered this little board game from Amazon. I'm gonna put a picture on the screen of how I thought it was gonna look. Maybe I should have read the directions, but when I just picked the package up off the porch last night, it was supposed to be like a little game, a little sexy game for me and my husband. Girl, I don't, it don't look nothing like what, it's not big enough to be what I thought it was. I thought it was an actual board game. And they feel about this big, so I'm guessing it's just the dice. I don't know, I should have read the print. I should have known it was only like $10. <laughs> so, um, I'm about to open that. Get in the car, meet Boo. He want, we want to go ahead and knock this, our Sunday buildings out of the way. Go ahead and knock them out of the way real quick. Um, and then I need to go by, probably I'll stop by Walmart, because it's a Walmart over there, and get Cam and Kaden the mount to mount the TV. I wonder if they have it done before they came home, but if I don't, still, they'll still have their set up for their room today. So get that mount, set their, set their new room up, build those boxes for their shoes. Um, I got a video loading now, so y'all will get a video today, Sunday, and then y'all will get this video now, Monday, and then hopefully I can get another video, video out Tuesday. I wanna get out at least, I wanna try to do four or five videos this week to make up for the time that we was in the hospital. Anyway, I don't wanna um keep talking. I'll see y'all in the car. Okay, y'all, we done with the building. Just got to Walmart, so let's head on in. We're not about to spend that much money here. I see some popsicles. It's getting cold, hot, hot outside, so I'm gonna grab these for the kids. And yeah, let me go to my phone, because I got a list. Babe, I seen $5 clearance, and I asked the ring over here. Let's see what they got. Hmm. This is cute. Is this on the $5 clearance? We getting this. We getting it. Five dollar clearance. Girl, don't be sleeping on these clearance racks. I done told y'all. Grab you these cute leather pants for next year. They four dollars. They don't look tall girl friendly, so I'm not gonna get them. But you short girls, run. Get here. But I'm definitely getting this five dollar day suit, girl. What you mean? I need this for today's meal. I got some peppers in here already. I need some carrots. Let's see. Which ones do I want? You know what? I don't feel like chopping. I think I'm gonna grab this. For Cameron sandwiches, we're completely out. Grab some more lunchables for Cameron. We need chips again already. They be running through these chips so bad. Let me see. What kind of I want this time? I didn't grab anything I didn't need, but I ended up spending more money than I said I was going to. So. Yeah. Anyway, let's see. Why do people still act like they don't know what a vlogger is? That's crazy to me. They really be literally stopping and staring. Did y'all just see that boy? Like, he literally stopped and was staring at me. You think I'm gonna cut my camera off? Nope, you cannot let nobody get in the way between you and your bag. Better get over that shyness. No, ma'am. All right, let me find these TV things. Oh, there they go. 32 to 86 inch. Perfect. All right, let's see what I got. Let's go. This was not supposed to happen. Let me show y'all. This is where Boo fixed it. Hold on, it's a glare. That's where Boo fixed it. See Oh, yeah. And I feel like he need to paint the whole car because it looked better. That one piece looked better than the whole car. He did so good. No, he do not paint cars for other people anymore. Okay, we're back home. We're in the boys' room. I'm pissed. 
because it's filthy after we just came in here and cleaned up. This is why you have to check on your kids every room, every two days. And it's my fault. I haven't been checking. But anyway, Boo is finding the studs so he can hang the TV. So, yeah. I'm mad now. I'm mad now. Who got the little, I don't know what it's called, bracket hung. I knew he could do it. I'm so glad we did not pay nobody $100 to do that. So now he's putting the thing on the back of the TV. And remember these lights I bought for Kaden, so I'm about to figure out how these, well, Kaden and Cam, but I'm about to figure out how the, these lights go. Yeah, let's figure this out. Okay, Boo got the TV up. This is how the lights look so far. They gonna be so surprised when they come home. So we did get it up before they came home. Hey y'all, I just washed and cleaned the turkey wings. So it's turkey parts and turkey wings. Now I'm about to cook it. <laughs> Taper, I guess that's what you call it. I don't know, but ain't my boy so handsome? Look, look at the people. Ain't he handsome? Say what's, what's up? What's up? <laughs> he smell good too. Smell good. Okay, y'all, I had to stop cooking because I didn't have any coconut milk, so I came to Target. Hopefully, they got coconut milk, but y'all see what I grow up. I grabbed all the, the red velvet cupcakes that they had, honey. My house is addicted. So, yeah, I got everybody one. I got five of them. Boo saying he want to buy the whole cake. But I think the cake don't taste like the cupcakes from what I remember. The cupcakes is a different flavor. But, anyway, let me find this coconut milk so I can get up out of here. Baby, one thing about that Target app is going to tell you which aisle it's on every time. If you're looking for something, just type it in on your Target app. It'll tell you to be at the top. Y'all can't see it, but it say aisle. W6 Morning, what's up, E Gang? Today is now Sunday. 
was Sunday. Today is now Monday. Oh, y'all saw some B-roll this the morning. So I am y'all. I'm dressed in professional attire today because um I am working today, but on my lunch break. I wanted to show y'all this part to show y'all like how you can maneuver and still get stuff done. Like, I mean, if you if you have a flexible job. So I'm taking an early lunch break. I'm doing what we call a one time clean. Um, I like one time cleans because they're kind of most of the time they're big ticket items. Um, you go in, you clean. This one is not that big, so I was able to do this one on my lunch break. Um, but normally it would be like a weekend job. You do it most of the time. It's like construction cleanups or something like that, and um, you get paid, you know, for that one time. And this one is not a huge one, but they're so, when they're big, they're the upwards of over a thousand dollars. So, um, but like I say, this one is not a big one. This is semi big. Um. Man, actually, it's not even big. It's only a thousand and thirty square feet, so I should be able to. Whoop, 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 whoop. So I'm dressed in professional attire today. Y'all know I normally wear whatever because nobody is in the building, but people will more than likely be in there today while I'm there. So you want to look professional, um, and yeah. So I'm headed there. I'm gonna do it on my lunch break. Boo is gonna meet me there and get this done, and then go back to work. So yeah it's just that's what you got to do when you when you got to go and you just trying to get somewhere that's just what you got to do if there's a will there's a way i've been up since 5 30 this morning i logged in for work early because i knew i would be doing this so just to get mondays are kind of crazy for me so just to catch up and do everything i needed to do make sure everything is good so like while i am on lunch break nobody don't need me everything caught up everything on up and up so yeah y'all saw me log in early Boo went ahead and filled my car up for me this morning. So when I got in the car, it was already full. So I didn't have to stop for that. So I'm grateful for that. Yeah, we headed to this building. I wanted to go in and open the vlog. Go ahead and open the vlog for today. I don't know if I'm going to film in here. Because especially with this not being one of my buildings. And there's people in here. I'm not going to film. Um, But I do want to say this for my people interested in doing the cleaning business. For the one time clean. This is a blind one time clean. So I don't know what I'm walking into. So I brought everything. Just come prepared. Just bring everything. I brought everything that I could possibly need. You know, Windex. Um bleach um all your cleaning supplies whatever you use i got my broom vacuum mop um i got everything in the trunk i brought even paper towels because you don't know if they'll have paper towels and then they might be the cheap ones and i brought my um i got i stopped yesterday and got some new cleaning cloths when i was at walmart um, so yeah, I just brought everything and I just come come prepare when you're doing a one-time clean or even a blind clean Like when you're going to if you do a blind clean for someone's house and everything just come prepare So you don't have to stop and go get anything just bring everything you need But anyway, I will more than likely call y'all back once I'm done. I just wanted to come in and say hey girl. Hey Okay, e gang. so I'm back. Um, so that was a construction clean. It was a waxing center and they were still in there doing construction so it was much i can do so we're going to reschedule it to when they're completely done because the thing about if you're doing the construction scheme make sure they're completely done because they're going to walk back over the floors they're going to get dust back on stuff and it's going to look like you didn't do a good job and you want to keep your name good in these streets so it was right down the street from a trader joe's i'm still on my lunch break so i'm about to run a trader we have not y'all we have not been to trader joe's in so long remember we used to take field trips to trader joe's all the time and get some fresh flowers and some food and stuff so i'm gonna go in here and get a couple things i want some tulips i've been craving yes craving to see some tulips in my i just want some spring cute little tulips so i want to make a pretty little arrangement so let's go and trade the shows real quick So let me show y'all really quick what I got from Trader Joe's. I gotta get back to work. I'm about, I got me a salad, which y'all about to see. I'm about to warm it um, to meet up in the air fryer, put my little salad together so I can eat that. And I gotta get back to work. But let me show y'all really quick. Hash brown patties, eggs, a Caesar salad, strawberries, milk, 
cheese bread balls, lasagna, two packs, lemon breast grilled chicken patties. This is a apple uh, flavored white wine. This is a Seco peach bellini. I got peony tulips, um, rice uh, flour for filler. I got some white tulips and I got some eucalyptus for my shower. I've never did that before. So yeah, that's everything that I got. Like I said, I've never did the um, eucalyptus in the shower, so we'll do that later. But I'm about to warm this chicken, warm one of these chicken breasts up in the um, in the air fryer, and I'm going to put it in this salad. And then, girl, this is what they having for dinner. I got two of them. This is going to be dinner. I don't feel like cooking a dinner today because they ate all that curry chicken. It's just a little bit the curry turkey wings. It's just a little bit left, so. This is what it is tonight so that I can get to editing and do things I need to do. And I'm just tired. I'm really tired today. Yeah. Say it. I wanna all night. I wanna all night. Say it. I wanna all night. I have no stranger. Babe's been waiting. Just as I recall, I asked still. Amazing. Playing back. Okay, gang, I just did my tulips. I left them out of water too long, so they kind of looking like they dying, but they'll come back together. I did ice and a cap of bleach and some cold water. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog right here, y'all. It's a lot going on tonight. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and please consider subscribing if you're new here. Love y'all. Bye. Yeah.